welcome back. This is part two of our video tutorial on using MyCap with RedCap projects here at NYU Langone Health. In the previous video, we talked about enabling MyCap on the project setup page and then enabling it for an individual questionnaire in our project and setting up the MyCap settings. In this video, we're going to talk about the app design features where we can customize how we want our app experience to be for our end users. So when I click on app design, First page it brings me to is this page for about information, where we can add multiple about pages providing general information about our study. If I click on uh, edit, we can change the title of the page. We can provide general information where we might thank our users and provide information on why we're collecting data and how it can be used, as well as possibly an image. Here I've just uploaded the NYU Langone Health logo, but we might choose to do things like a departmental or possibly a study uh, logo so that users who are coming to our project recognize that it's connected to the actual official project and don't feel any questions about that relationship there. As we go through, we can also preview these features. So here we can see what this would eventually look like on a phone. We can go across, add contact information so our users have a page to go to where they can see who to contact about any questions they might have. If I click on edit, we can add information, a phone number, an email, perhaps even a website or additional information for our end users. And again, as before, we can preview what this looks like. We could ask, also add any links. So perhaps if our site has a, our study has a website, we might add that here. And finally, we could choose to update the theme. I've currently got it on the default blue theme. There's also the ability to uh, make updates down here. Should be noted that these will not be on all devices. So uh, to my mind, it probably doesn't make sense to go too far worrying about the updates, uh, but it is an, op an option if you really are interested for having the theme to match for certain users, bearing in mind it won't show up for everyone. I'll also note that both on the online designer and on that previous page, when we've made changes before they'll show up on a uh, MyCap site, we do have to publish the new MyCap version. So just to click on our questionnaire, make sure everything looks as we want it to for our app use. So here at the top, we have all of those automated fields that automatically came uh, loaded in once we enabled MyCap. And then once we go down, I've got some demo questions, how much sleep, what was your last meal, did you have a beverage, really trying out some of these multiple choice and check field questions using branching logic to uh, provide more on that. But we can go and we can publish to MyCap and it published there. In the next video, we're going to go ahead and take a look at what this looks like on a mobile device.